giveaway time. Don't forget, we're giving away a pair of LED ox beam headlights like we installed in Boosty. The link to the video and official rules, everything you need to know is gonna be below. So check it out. Okay, we're at storage. You wanna see our code? Okay, I'll show you. Hmm. Wow. It's pretty still. What's going on here, sir? We got Gandhi. Dandy. Look at this car. Awesome. Dandy off road's never been so high. <laughs> <laughs> we'll be back. Here's what it looked like before. Oh, real quick, check this out. This is going to be attached to our trailer today. I see no tin. There's not a tin. Oh, four seven sixteenths. No yeah, tin. Exactly. Let me bring them up here. Yeah. Yeah, take a look at that. Here's what I'm thinking. See that? All right, like let's it. give it a shot. We'll be right back. We are officially raising the Dandy Off-Road flag. Okay, so we have been hanging out at home. I mean, not just hanging out, I've been working. Uh, we've been really busy. We've been organizing the house. I yeah. have been organizing the house. And uh, again, we don't get into politics, uh, opinions, any of that, but uh, it does look like California will be reopened. <gasps> what? Soon, hopefully, some off-roading will be available to us soon. Regardless of how soon it is, we need to be ready, and that's what we're doing today, right? Today's prep day. Today's prep day. Countdown to wherever. So, we were eating some food, look at that. <laughs> so, here's part of the prep. You know, the car, of course. Awesome. Anyway, that's what's going on. Yeah. We're gonna start with... We're gonna start with the doors. Yes. So, we're gonna start with the doors, and here's what's going on, right? We bent this door right out of the gate. Well, I mean, that was I, our bad. mostly Brandy, I blame it on her. Right, my door has never flung open since we got the new doors. What was that? My door has never flung open since we got the new sturdy doors. Okay, so I broke the door. <laughs> That's what really happened. But we have some new skins. We have had them all along. We're starting over. We don't have stickers, right? We're not doing stickers today. Stickers. We're just gonna go with a clean look for a little bit. We're doing a fresh look on the car. We'll show you some more about that in a minute. Here's the new door skins are gonna go on. Clean, freshen this thing up. We yeah, have no, these. Those stickers could be infested with the Coronas. And look at these. <gasps> yeah, here, let me hold it up. We got these from Freedom Ropes, Off-Roaders United. Okay. Look at that. So one of the other things we're gonna do is we're gonna go over we have uh, our lighted whips in the trailer. We have to go get them. We'll take you with us. Those came from Steveson Motorsports. They did. Our source for lighting and other uh, odds and ends. And then we also have this. Check this guy out. What is this guy? This uh, is a flag holder. This is our, our pole mount thingy. Here's the ball. Goes Good right job. there. And this is the extendable my bobber that goes mounted to the side of our trailer so I no longer have to climb up on the roof and use duct tape. You'll see it later. Yeah, our it's flag an extendable will be pole. I think it's pole. It's 22 feet. Yep. And what we're going to do, we're going to go grab our all of our flags and we're going to put our biggest flag on this and that's going to go on the trailer. It's going to, here's an indicate, like here's like a little sneak peek. And this came from Robert Mello's pole service. Thanks, Rob. Look at that. Yeah. Woo. That's a, yeah. Except a lot bigger. A lot. The flag we have is a lot bigger. That was not to scale. All right, so we'll be right back. We're gonna put these doors on. We're gonna swap out the door skins. We're gonna start, the car is dirty. It got sprayed off, but it's not clean, clean. I like looking at it. Yeah, a little dusty. But anyway, we'll do that in a little bit. We're right just now. gonna go for a clean look because we bent this one. We've been using it this way. We have our, all of our cool decals on it. Right. But uh, we'll revisit that at a later time. Right now, we're starting fresh. Remember when we wanted it all blacked out? Yep, it's gonna be all blacked out. So, we're also going to do flags and stuff like that. We're showing you a little bit. We're going to do a cool project. We're going to go to the trailer. We're going to put up that pole we got as a test. We're going to get flags. You'll know this car by the flags, it's not right. the decals for right now. Yeah, I don't sorry. remember how long ago it's been since we got these doors. But anyway, regardless, it's been several months. Like the sand show time. Yeah. Yeah. So since September, this is uh, uh, end of mid April. So. We have definitely had a chance to use these doors to uh, run them a lot through, oh, the, you, you through the through the dunes and beat them beat on them Did pretty good. Yeah. As a matter of fact, this one here. 
The reason it looks like this is because no less than three times I'm going to leave the door unlatched like that, long back, and almost rip the door off. Right. And just to show you real quick, so it did break this, have not dealt with that yet. There's plenty of things to do, deal with that I need to do, but that right. hasn't gotten done. Um, the door frames are solid, mm -hmm. didn't bend, didn't hurt it in any way. I think this one, actually, I thought it needed adjustment, but it doesn't. Um, anyway, they mount at the OEM spot location, factory location. They're rock solid. We've had no issues with them. These frames are super they're heavy fit. Duty. Yeah, they're heavy duty. Wait, let me show something on this door, my door. Look at that. Just That's weird. Brand new looking. Mmm. How's that? <laughs> Do you know what? So, <laughs> how's it look now? <laughs> Same. This door is rock solid as well. Yeah. No issues. Nope. We've had no issues with these doors. They use the stock. Uh, the stock latch, uh, but it, they do come with this cool handle that connects to it. Awesome. With, yeah, love this. So it's we say, nice wait, side. how many thumbs up? 14 thumbs up. Oh, there's one, there's my other. What are we using We've today? We've got a couple off here. Here's the thing I just went to find tools. We have, this garage has no wrench. Wait, come on, look. Okay. Come on, look. <clears throat> so we have this fairly big toolbox. Right. And we have this tool cart. Uh -huh. uh, oh, right there, we have an empty drawer. Don't worry about that. We have, like, here's our sockets, right? Right. Look at that. Okay. Oh, wait, I know where some wrenches are. Oh, I know. Here's a random assortment. Oh. Of, these are just a collection, collection of wrenches Over the I've had since I was a kid. Mm -hmm. So a lot of really old, beat-up sockets, wrenches. So good to have. Yeah. So, but, here's a 7 sixteenths. We need a 10. Weird. A 10. Here's, we don't have a 10. Here's three 7 right there. No 10. I see no 10. There's not a 10. Oh, four 7 sixteenths. No 10. Is so that we're going to swap really out those door skins. We do have a 10 socket. That says uh, 5 30 seconds. So that's the Allen that we're going to use because that those door skins have Allen screws. We I think we swapped out the original. It had like some stainless steel. Yep. We swapped them out for black. I don't know why. So, I do know why because it looks cool. Yeah. Anyway, we have a couple of options here for that. We have a socket for the back, for the nut on the back. We have this cool thing that that we're gonna use. He left it here. So. Yeah, he, yeah. So we're, yeah. <gasps> I didn't know he did that. He just accidentally left it here. He'll come and get it back, but we're gonna borrow it right now. So here we go. Oh, real quick, check this out. This is going to be attached to our trailer today. I think we're gonna go over there today. We're gonna take you with us. We're gonna attach this to the ladder of the trailer, I think. And the pole, our new 22 foot pole, flag pole. Is going on this. We'll take you on that adventure in a minute. Right now, we're, let's do the doors. Okay. Oh, you know what? I want to do something. I'm going to pull the car. Oh, yeah. Oh, look at this. Huh? Put all our keys. I know. Uh, right here where they belong. On a rock. <clears throat> Garage is still pretty clean, guys. Pretty clean. Did I leave something on? No, I didn't turn anything on. All right. Well, apparently we have a battery draw issue we need to deal with. Yeah, because we have a new battery, don't we? Didn't we put that new battery in? Yep, brand new battery. And nothing's on. Anyway, so we're gonna have to push the car. Oh, God. Okay. All right, so the battery's dead again. I don't think it's a draw issue. I think it's just that we left the radios on a while back. We didn't run the car. It hasn't had a chance to charge. Uh, stuff like that. So, yeah. Here we go. Let's swap this door out. All right. Kind of excited to see it all black again. All right. Yeah. We, uh, sure. we kept our PRP uh, door bags. Uh -huh. They don't exactly fit in here perfectly, but they do work. They've worked fine. Yeah. They had a little like knee pad thing that went yeah. right here. Obviously, we can't use that because we have that handle. 
we're gonna pop those out of the way real quick. Actually, I'll just pop it up. Just gonna pop it up like that. Now it's still connected, huh? Yep. These. All these little guys out. I just threw that. Mm -hmm. All right, where'd it go? Oh, there it is. Wow, you found me out for yourself. All right. What am I even here for? I need this guy. Look at that. Oh, yeah. Hi. Boom. All right. take off the rest of these and we'll come right back. Okay. Last one. All right, here's the last one. I don't have anyone to help me even hold this up, so. I know. <laughs> Jenny, we miss you. That's what that meant. All right. <laughs> okay, here we go. Door scan off. Look at that. That was up easy. Oh, man. Yeah. We love these. No. But we're just doing, it's time for something yeah. new to happen. There's going to be a bunch of new stuff happening. Yep. Yeah. Well, let's do Look at that door. You've been good. You've been good, stickers. All you guys. Awesome. Okay. All right. Here we go. This one's going on. New door. New life. You know, while we have that. See, that's the right one? Yeah. 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 All right. While we have the skin off, let's take a look at this. Uh, let's look at this frame one more time. Okay. Yeah, that thing's solid. It does definitely, look, there's no twist. No it definitely does not need the door skin to hold it together. It looks like you have an invisible door on there. We had some, I don't remember what brand they are. I'm not going to go into it. They were actually decent doors. On the Razor, uh -huh. when you had the door skin off these, they were, they were pretty fuxy. Yeah. They were, oh, a little, yeah. they were a little flimsy, but they did hold up. We never had an issue. But these uh, the dirt specialty doors are definitely more solid. Yeah. So. Super. Let's get that door skin and see what it looks like. Okay. Invisible doors. We clean them so much. You rub too hard. Yeah, we rub too hard. Look at that. <laughs> wow. Yeah, we did a little too much cleaning. Yeah. All right, let's, let's go. Let's put it on. Let's put that skin on. Okay, this new shiny. Ooh, ah. I got dirty handprints on it already. Right. All right, here we go. Take a couple of these. It's gonna be cool. It's gonna be cool. Oh, it's gonna be cool. Oh, I know. I said it before you said it. Oh, it's gonna be cool. I already said that. I don't. That is a really handy dandy little. Uh, it is. Magnetized. Let's take it with us. What's going on? There's sticks up there. Oh, it doesn't stick up there. That's plastic. This is true. <laughs> All right, we're gonna just drop a, a couple of screws in the top to hold it in place. This is totally helping, I'm sure. I'm just like holding it up for you. It is. Basically, it's holding it on itself. Okay. Okay. All right. All right. So much. You rub too hard. Yeah, rub too hard. Look at that. <laughs> wow. Yeah, we did a little too much cleaning. Yeah. All right. Let's, let's go. Let's put it on. Let's put that skin on. Okay, this new shiny, ooh, ah. I got dirty handprints on it already. Right. All right, here we go. Take a couple of these. It's gonna be cool. It's gonna be cool. Oh, it's gonna be cool. Oh, I know. I said it before you said it. Oh, it's gonna be cool. I already said that. I don't. That is a really handy dandy little, uh. It is. Magnetized. Let's take it with us. 
Oh, I didn't see that guy. That's faster. This is true. <laughs> All right, we're gonna just drop a, a couple of screws in the top to hold it in place. This is totally helping, I'm sure. I'm just like holding it up for you. It is. Basically, it's holding it on its mouth. Okay. Okay. Reservations in July for Pismo, but that's for Trash Bash 4.0. Um, that's July 11th. 11th. It's actually July 10th. Uh, Friday, July 10th. We're going. The Trash Bash is the 11th. Okay. Yeah. Well, I would suspect that either we make a trip up to some place like Miami Trails, oh. with the dirt tires on, or yeah. a day trip, to, or even a weekend trip to Pismo. Yeah. Prior to said date. Yeah. Have we taken the Can Am to Tamarack? I know we used to get sideways in the razor, but I don't think we did this. I don't know if we ever have, ever. We've oh been so God. busy. I was just talking to John Sherfie about that. We have been so busy with this YouTube thing, like, you know, chasing down the the meets with MTS and KMS and Burger Radios and Geyser and all those guys in Pismo to, you know, to look at products, to do reviews, to do stuff like that, that uh, we're always scheduling Glamis. And don't get me wrong, we love I love Glamis. Glamis. Yeah. But and yeah, then, that'd be cool. Let's do that. Yeah, and then Get during, a group together. Everybody's going to be ready for a ride soon. And then during the summer, we're always, we always always have some kind of schedule to be scheduled to be in Pismo, which we also love. Yeah. But it's just kind of locked us out of doing a lot of other things for the last couple of years. This is the year we do some other stuff too, huh? This is the this year. This year's going to be different. Of the Aquarius. This, this is month? the year of the tiger. No. <laughs> bum, 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 bum. Here we go. Right. Looks like the back could come up a little, huh? Yeah. All right, let's fix that real quick. What about putting natural frame on? Is that a human job? Not at all, no. No, you could definitely do this by yourself for sure. Oh, it wouldn't come down because... Back. We're going to tighten the rest of these up and we'll be back. Alright. Okay, so we finished up the other side. We'll show you some more in a minute, right? Right. right. We totally did. But this is basically what it looks like. Well, basically, this is what it looks like. The car is semi clean. Oh, I got some handprints on it. The car is semi clean. Got some odd lighting. I'll show you this other side when we're done. How about that? For right now, let's do some time lapse. Here we go. Okay, I didn't realize that last screw was the last screw. So I dropped the whole thing on the ground. Hopefully didn't drop too many bolts. Yeah. Let's put it back together. What do you think? I think I'm excited to see it done. So hurry up. All right, I'm gonna wipe this off and then we'll put it back together. We'll be right back.
Okay. The door skins are swapped out. What do you think? I think that they look amazing. And you were right again. I'm always hesitant. Sorry. No more. Of course I was Get right. Get it on video. I'm going to listen to you from now on. Of course I was right. So what we're doing is we're going to go for a clean look. Super clean look. Ready? So we're going to go for a blacked out, super clean look. Something like this. I'm not sure what else we're going to change. Oh my gosh, that's terrifying. <laughs> of course, still not super clean yet. But blacked out, clean look. Um, dandy off-road flags. Yeah. You know, we're going to represent our people. We're just, the car itself is a uh, clean slate. Start yeah. over. Redo. So stay tuned because we have, we actually, all joking aside, we have something really big coming up. Is that right? We are heading out to Tractor Supply to pick up a few essential items. Mm -hmm. And then we're going to put them on for you. All right. So we are going to be out and about a little bit. Uh, things are starting to relax. We have not been gone. We're not going around any people other than to make a stop at Tractor Supply, which we need to make anyway which we will for uh, some essential items. And since we're there, we're going to grab a hose clamp or two for this. We need to go buy storage. We have to check on the trailer because it's been raining. And we are going to check out this flag mount, this flagpole, I mean, flagpole on the trailer. Okay. Like we talked. We're getting out. We're getting out. It's been a little bit. We've been uh, hiding out. Laying it's, low. It's Yeah, we've been laying low, doing what we're supposed to do. We haven't been around anybody but each other. Um... So now we're going to go out carefully. We still have all of our stuff with us, but things are things are easing up. We're not going to go crazy. We're not going to go anywhere but to pick up things that we need so that we can stay not crazy. This is a true fact. Yeah, fact. All right, we'll be right back. We're going to go put this... Uh, I was doing some rough calculations in my head. Did this thing's just shift, honey. Don't you dare. Uh, Don't you dare, like, Boosty. Uh, engine oil something. Is uh, it? Don't you dare shift, funny Boosty. Remember that whole... For any of you that watch the uh, channel on a regular basis, if you were watching, I don't know, a year ago now, maybe less. Yeah. Yeah. Shift funny, truck need work. Anyway, I don't think that was it. No, yeah, I it think just... that it's just not used to being driven. Yeah. All, All right. cars have gone crazy. We will be back. What's going on here, sir? We got Gandhi. Look at this car. Mm. Mm -hmm. It's usually real good, but. Mm. I think it's down. Hmm. Wow. It's pretty stale. It's still good. Um. Okay. Mm-hmm. What's our stuff? Hold on, we'll be right back. Got the stuff we needed at Tractor Supply so we can um, put our bag on. Mm-hmm, yeah, all this. Well, all this, which is what? Okay, we got... Most importantly, marshmallow cups. Mm -hmm. We got some PVC cement, glue, whatever, mm -hmm. to glue the PVC. We got these things to be uh, revealed we'll what we're using them for. Mm -hmm. A couple different sizes of the old hose clampers. Mm -hmm. And we got one of these uh, new quarter inchers because all of ours are MIA. That's true. It's, they're kind of, it's kind of like 10 millimeter sockets. Anyway, we got all this stuff. We're gonna go check on our trailer right now. We're gonna check out our flagpole while we're there. We're gonna grab our big dandy off-road flag. We'll show you we'll show you what it looks like. I thought we would put it up on the trailer, drive around, go outside of the Yes, storage. and see how far away you can see. Yeah. Okay, so I was calculating the trailer's about um, 13 feet high. Say so you drop down a foot, so say 12 feet, plus the pole itself is 22 feet. So, that's 34 feet. So it's going to stick up 34 feet in there. Holy cannoli. That's awesome. Dandy off-road's never been so high. <laughs> <laughs> we'll be back. And we haven't had food outside of the house for a while. Woke up this morning. Eddie goes, I sent you a text. It's on your phone. We should get, see if Dickies is open. We need ribs. The text said, is Dickies open? We need ribs. That was before he woke up. Before I woke up. That's what happened. We have had no food outside of the house for six weeks, True. five weeks. But I've been doing some good cooking, have I? Okay, I take it back. We had a little bit of McDonald's last night. Oh, That's that not. doesn't even count. I got the wrong sauce. It's just, 
It was kind of a bad deal. Actually, I love chicken McNuggets. I don't care what anybody thinks. I do too. I know it's not actually chicken. It's just like, I'm pretty sure a that they- A big old pink bowl of glob that gets squeezed into a, not even yeah. a shape of a nugget and then just like plopped into some oil. Yeah, uh, we love that. We love I imagine that. it comes in uh, like a toothpaste too. Oh yeah, you like squeeze a it out. But a big one. A dollop of it, bloop, it drops in the oil, makes that plop sound, fries right up into that delicious golden nugget. Mm. Yeah. But whatever they do, it's so tasty. Yeah, it's so tasty. But this, that was real food. We had ribs. Actually, ribs. that was the ribs off of an animal. We didn't get beef because we're vegetarians. But, <laughs> I mean, vegans, really. But we're anyway. beefkins. Hmm? I don't know. All right, we'll be back. Uh, okay, what's going on? Go into the storage and we're putting a pole on the trailer. Okay, we're at storage. You want to see our code? Okay, I'll show you. Okay, there it is. Now you can get in. Great. Now you know the code is 17489er Golf 8 India. <laughs> All right. So we're going to go over here. We're going to find our trailer and we're going to put a stripper pole. If on we it. had a flag on it, we'd have already found it. Yeah. Maybe. Luckily, we know where Thank it's you, at. Thank you. So there's another way. We. Yeah. yeah, one of our uh, one of our friends that rides with us has been in some videos. You've Rob, you've seen him. He uh, hooked us up with this pole. So <laughs> awesome! We'll be right back. There it is. There it is. It's even more beautiful than I remember. So we bought this trailer. We made one trip to Glamis. I went to Pismo. And then now we're on lockdown. I'm not complaining too much because people. Yeah, sick. we we have it pretty yeah. easy. So we're we're not complaining a lot. We we yeah. have been we have been blessed during this thing, and we feel good about um, um, being able good to about, share that. Yeah, well, I feel like we've done. You know, we've made sure that um, we've stayed inside and listened to what we were supposed to be doing, and yeah, we've definitely tried to make sure that we ourselves don't get infected. If this is a big deal, some people don't believe it, and. And we then the have people around us, which is hardly anyone, or if we ever happen to go out, we're very, very cautious about making sure that we carry always a bag of hand sanitizer. I'm, in case I've been exposed to anything, don't want to pass that on. I would hate that. So, yeah. So for those of you that uh, believe it's a serious issue, that's what we're doing. For those of you that don't, just in case, that's what we're doing. That's still what we're doing. And that's what we're doing. Awesome. Yeah. Oops, we erred. We were yeah. wrong, and a bunch of people lived. Anyway, so <laughs> here. There's the trailer, and we cannot wait to check it out. I'm we want to bring it home, but I know. it's just a lot of work. It's not a lot of work. We're just lazy, that's all. We got other work to do is the real thing. Yeah. So right now we're going to check out this pole. I'm excited. Okay, so first I'm going to go back here. Would you grab that PVC? Let's go back here and scope out our mounting techniques. Oh. All right, we're going to go back here and take a look at this. Because I, I think the plan is that we are going to... Uh, Hook that PVC that we bought to the ladder, right? To the ladder, right there, somewhere up there. So I'm gonna pull these pins so that we can climb up there. Ouch. And I'm gonna just like crack the crack out of my thumb right now. Cause that's an awesome thing to do. Yeah, look at that. Look at it. All right. I'm gonna throw those right down there. Let's take a look. What is happening here? We're taking a look. So what the plan is, I'm taking some, oh, look at that. Oh, that's perfect, huh? Yeah. So all we gotta do is maybe clamp it there and then make sure we can close the ladder up. Yeah. I like it. I like it too. Can the camera see that? I'm gonna go on this side. Right? Yeah. yeah. Let me bring them up here. Yeah. Yeah, take a look at that. Here's what I'm thinking. See that? All right, like let's it. give it a shot. We'll be right back. Here we are. Okay, we're at the storage and we're just doing this real quick, just, you know, because we haven't been out at all. And we're, this is like a safe place. There's no one here. Yeah, there's no one here. We're not near anybody, no one's near We're us. touching our trailer. Do you need me to get you something to open that with? Wow. Unfortunately, I think everything we bought is right here. No. Oh, why don't you put a 
a clamp around it oh and then hook into God. it with a screwdriver and loose. That doesn't make any sense. So well, here's what we did. Okay. I just clamped it like that. And then I went. Good job. Good job. That was a team effort because I thought of the first part and then I was like, oh, that won't work. My brain stopped right then. And you were like, yeah, it will. Let's it, it, it worked. Play. It worked. Okay. All we're doing is just. All we gotta do is glue this cap on real quick. I just don't want to bolt this all up there and then have this cap come off later. Yeah. Uh, so I've got some I don't know if I got the right PVC glue. I don't know if it's the right stuff or not. It's weird. Right or not, it's what we're using. It's gonna be great. Right or wrong. Got this. Right or wrong. It's Test fit down low. Make sure yep. this whole deal works out according to plan. So that's gonna go like that, but up higher, of course. Um, and. Where's the guy? Hold on. These pieces right here are going to go over the ladder to clamp onto. Nice. So the ladder doesn't get all scratched, it, huh? Yeah. I like that. So here we go. We're going up. I'm getting high off the Do you want me to go up there and do it? No, I got it. Okay. I'll hold that pole until you need it. Good job, Brandy. One job. You had one job. Hold on. Okay, careful, okay? Okay. Okay. The and trailer then... is about, this mount point will be about 12. Okay. 11, 12. We're going to be over 30 feet high. Oh, yeah. Nice. Do you uh, need that tool to zoop? Make it tight? I have it. Yeah. Oh. Of course you do. I forgot who I was married to for a minute. MacGyver, MacHoover. <laughs> I need the MacGyver theme song. Bring the clamp way down here in place. Ah, spin around and put the screw back here. All right. Something like that. Everything looks good. We did, you know, it's funny. This is one thing I didn't look up. I didn't YouTube. So we're probably going to find there's a much easier, better way to do it. But we needed this to do. I like that we came up with it on our own. It's how dandy does I mean, Rob, I think Rob did kind of throw the general idea out there for sure. Oh, he did, yeah. PVC time. But I mean, as far as the execution. Right. Uh, Man. Wow, that is solid. That's a solid. Good. That's a solid enchilada. That's a solid enchilada? Yeah. That's a whole lot of enchilada. So now all we gotta do is track our flags down. And, um,. Chuck our flags down and pop it in there. Put the flag on the pole and put the pole up there. Uh, do you want me to go get the keys and go get the flag and you get the holder? Yes. Okay. Uh, we'll be back. Look at this. Wait, let's oh. check this. Oh. Here's okay. the. Let's make sure this is going to work out. Uh oh. What's the on? <laughs> I'm going to move it down. Oh, okay. See it? Yep. See the problemo? Yep. So that top clamp's got to come down some. Um, so how what's much? the current status? Okay, well, up that high, run, we run into a few problems. The hose clamp hits the mount when we close up the ladder. The top of the PVC hits this part of the mount. So we're going to actually have to drop it down quite a ways. That's okay. It's still going to be high. Yeah, absolutely. So we're going to back to the Yeah, today's about cleaning some stuff up. Streamline. <laughs> Solid. Okay. That's. I just don't like the way that top clamp is on there, though. So Why is it so Make it a little more even, Steven. All right. Or only cool kids do it. Okay. <laughs> All right, let's see what happens. 
Here we go. Ready? Da, is it gonna work this time? Da, da. Yeah. Yay! I really am that excited that I said it like that. Yay! <laughs> okay, we'll be back in a minute. Okay. Uh, Brandy Hoover here with Dandy Off Road live at the scene of a flag pole, a flag raising ceremony. Uh, sir, please surprise the viewers. Is uh, Corin? All right. So we got a big Dandy Off Road flag. You have it. White. This one right here. It's a big one. Pretty big one. Yeah. Um, and then we have our new pole. Right. Rock mm -hmm. Mellow. Ordered for us. Mm -hmm. And then we got all the hardware that goes with the flag. Mm -hmm. Right. Right. So what we're gonna do is get all that hardware out. We're gonna open up this pole. Set everything aside so we don't lose anything on the front uh -huh. right there. Uh, and then we got to figure out how this goes together. So apparently, I, yeah. do some. And we're doing that all here in the trailer. In the some trailer kind park. of magic like this, apparently. Right. Oh yeah. That's the last one, probably, or one of the last ones, because it's smaller than the other one. Yeah. Hmm. If, is there an instruction book that I can look over for you, or? Uh, we already looked. Remember, there was pretty much nothing. Oh. I don't know. If I can look true. online. No, we're good. Okay. I think we're good. Think well, we're good. Uh, we will be back when the pole has been assembled. Yeah? Yeah. Okay. Okay, here we go. Here we go. We figured out how these pieces go on. Pretty straightforward. And they got these little clevises. Like Do so. hickeys. Do hickey medillas. And they go like that. Oh. And then the bottom one goes like uh, on the bottom one. And it goes on the bottom one, so it goes down here on the bottom, wherever the bottom one goes. Right. And pull it down some more. There. Okay. Like so. All right. So we're not doing zip ties and duct tape, huh? Nope. Out of that world. This is official stuff right here. I know. Like this Whoop is up. legit. This is legit right here. Would uh. you say that you would not quit? Too legit. Yeah, you can't quit, huh? To be a dunk. <laughs> okay. Oh my god. Wow, look at that. So that is a... Now we're getting into the bigger ones and we need some... Oh, it wants to take off. Oh. I got these. Pins. Oh, look, those look just like our ladder pins. Huh. Okay. Go on here. It's just so majestic. Go on. Wow. I feel like I'm flying a kite. Let's do it. Why don't you go fly a kite? Go fly a kite. Okay. Wow. That it? thing. Oh, there's it's, another one. Oh, shoot. It's uh, large. It's pulling on me pretty good. Here, let me. Here we go. All right. We're, oh, oh, man. We forgot one little thing. Hold on. What? Hold on. Everybody, the ball? Everybody relax. Ah. Okay, stand back and get this. Wow. I mean, how are you going to get home ball. if you ain't, how are you going to go home if you ain't got no chrome? <laughs> Boom. Chrome. Boom. Bling, bling. I just made that sound. We are officially raising the Dandy Off-Road flag. Okay, On this day, April 18th, 2020, let it be known, <laughs> is now declared Dandy Off-Road Day. <laughs> we say so. In the, we will be the only ones celebrating it. In the hood, or storage, as some call it. Yeah. Okay. We didn't uh, test fit this at all. Oh, yeah, we didn't. Oh, that. man, is it perfect. It is, huh? Oh, yeah. Look at that. Guys, can you see how, can you see this, guys? Probably not as awesome as I can, but oh, man, babe. There we go. Wow. Is it pretty cool? Yeah. Remember, you need to get that mic in front of you. That is way cool, right? Oh, crap. That's big. Wow. 
I want to see it from the front of our trailer. How's that? Wait, look at this. Look at that over there. Show them that. I know. I am. Okay. Man, I can't imagine. You buy that. That's a $30,000 car. We've shown you it before. Just sitting in the storage. Not covered. Nothing. But look at this. Look at that. Look at that. Dandy off road. No joke. Pretty cool. Well, look, we haven't seen the trailer for a while. Let's take a peek. Who's inside? Look at that. It's dark, I know. Okay, let's go check out this flag. Look at this flag. What do you think? Look at it. What do you think? I think it's amazing. Holy smokes, yeah. Rob, thank you. That's pretty cool. We're gonna find camp and everything, guys. Now when we go ride and you want to come see and hang out with us, look for the flag. Sometimes it'll look like that if there's no wind. Yep. But that's still our flag, you can see. Yep. If it's windy, it'll be opening up and, come on wind. All right, let's do this. Let's grab all of our tools, pack them up, okay. leave the flag on, and let's go drive and see how far we can see it. Okay. We'll be back. So here's what we're doing. We're at storage, we put the flag up, we put the flagpole up. Now we're going to go drive around, right? Right. And see how far we can see it. Goofy, right? I know. But you got to understand, we've been in the house for five weeks. And also... We can't go anywhere. You also have to understand that even if we hadn't been in the house for five weeks... We'd still do this. That's what? We're just goofy. Let's look. See it? I still see it. Guys, there's the wind. Can see it. Bam. Aww. Thanks, Danny and Leah. You guys got that flag for us. Freedom Ropes, uh, Jerk Pirates Off Road Recovery Group, Off Roaders United. They they got these flags made for us because they love us. And look how cool it looks. Thank you, guys. So awesome. Oh man. So, do you love it? Yeah. Alright, we're gonna go out onto the roads. Onto the roads. So you're telling me that people that are just driving can oh, see that nice. bus. <laughs> we're not gonna leave it up. Oh, no, we gotta do Look at that. Definitely gonna be a great camp marker, too. Sure. That's the highest flag in the whole trailer park. <laughs> <laughs> that's awesome. Alright, that's pretty cool. That's awesome. Thank you. Uh oh. You. Okay, check that out. We're at the stop sign. And we can see Dandy Off Road flag right there. We can see Dandy Off Road flag right, see right there. It's right there. That is so cool. At the stop sign. I think it looks so neat. I think it's rad. Pretty freaking rad. Via church. There it is. What's going on up there? I am stealing this flag. Why are you I way up? It. Why are you so far up there? What? Why are you so far up there? Because right, I wanted to not flag. risk letting this ring out and me like losing this because it's windy. Okay. I got it. I'll okay. come on down. Cool. So much easier. Easier than trying to duct tape that other thing on there? Yeah, way easier. And it looks better too. <laughs> Let's see. Da -da -da -da. I'm gonna put this in the wall. Yeah. Alright, lower the flag. Lower the flag. Wow, it did look neat. We saw it from, we could have seen it from further away. Had we gone further. <laughs> right. We could hang it from our um, roof at the house. We have PVC pipe there too.